This video shows a strange laser beam that strikes a rocket and destroys it in mere milliseconds. Many people believe this was the Iron Beam, Israel's most advanced anti-air laser system. But how does this laser gun work exactly? And what is the Iron Beam in the first place? This video shows how Iron Beam works in action. It spots a rocket and immediately fires a laser at it, blowing it up into pieces. It can also target drones and even mortars, a small military shell that is hard to intercept. The iron beam consists of three main parts. The laser gun itself, a surveillance system that tracks incoming missiles, and a command center where operators manage the operation. The laser gun fires a fiber optic beam that uses 100 kilowatts of power, the same amount of electricity that the average US household uses in three days. It is an experimental project built by the Israeli defense company Rafael, the same company that made the Iron Dome, one of the most advanced air defense systems in the world that currently protects Israel from Hamas's rockets. Israel Defense Ministry plans to integrate the Iron Beam system into its arsenal and save the money it spends on a single interceptor missile, which costs $50,000, while the Iron Beam can intercept a rocket for as little as $2. Plus, the Iron Beam doesn't use any ammunition, only a large amount of power. But this is not a silver bullet against rockets, as many people believe. The system's sensors can be hampered in cloudy and rainy conditions, making the operation of a system in colder months such as November and December practically impossible. When the weather disrupts the laser, there is one more issue that can make the system ineffective. It's short range. As the laser travels through the air, it loses its impact on the target, making a laser beam less powerful. It's also known as the bloom effect. But most of all, it takes time for a laser to affect an object. While the laser touches the rocket at the speed of light, it needs to stay on it for seconds until the rocket is damaged and explodes. And it takes some time, unlike the traditional interceptor that explodes on the impact. This video does not show the iron beam laser because it destroys the rocket instantly with no bright laser in sight for a long period of time. Instead, this is a Tamir interceptor missile fired from the Iron Dome air defense system that engaged what's likely a Kassam rocket. The video is out of focus, which creates a lens flare that has been misidentified as a laser. The iron beam system is not due to be operational until 2025. However, the defense ministry started testing the system quite often and may deploy it much sooner to help counter Hamas's rockets.